How to set a broken bone if the world is dead, your best friend just ate pavement, and suddenly you're the closest thing to a doctor in a 50-mile radius. Your scavenging buddy trips over rubble and snaps their ankle like a wishbone. They're down, you're up, and the nearest hospital is now a mutant breeding ground. Time to channel your inner battlefield medic with nothing but trash and adrenaline. Solution. Emergency orthopedics, wasteland style. Start by raiding that abandoned car for seatbelts. Cut them loose with whatever blade you've got. Find two straight branches or metal pipes. Test them against your own leg. If they reach from hip to heel, perfect splint material. Cushion those sticks with whatever soft, old sleeping bag stuffing, car seat foam, even wadded up newspapers work. Comfort's a luxury, but circulation isn't. Position the splints on both sides of the brake. Wrap those seatbelts tight enough to immobilize everything. Loose enough that their toes don't turn purple. Need crutches? Two Y-shaped branches and some crossbar padding. Height matters. Armpit to ground. Minus two inches. Immobilization prevents bone fragments from shredding surrounding tissue. Your buddy's body will start laying down new calcium within hours. If they can hobble without crying, you're a hero. If they can't, well, at least you kept the bone from turning into soup. Like and subscribe for more survival tips.